honoring those who served. This morning, about 100 people gathered in Linwood to place 4,400 flags on the graves of veterans. Fox 13's Shira Matsuzawa has a look at today's ceremony. 41 years. With three syllables and a single answer, you can hear what serving 41 years in the Army means to retired Sergeant Major Christopher Young. 41 years came and went, and I still love wearing the uniform. On Saturday, he, along with dozens of others, gathered at Purdy and Walters at Floral Hills Funeral Home and Cemetery to place flags on the graves of veterans. But before that, the American Heritage Girls held an opening flag ceremony. Honor the colors. Followed by the Pledge of Allegiance, a prayer, and national anthem. Oh, say can you see? Bridget Simmons is the American Heritage Group's troop leader. She says she felt honored to be at Saturday's event. I feel it's really important for the young people to learn about the veterans who have served our country to protect the freedoms that we enjoy here in America. The flag that has been trampled, has been whatever, but it means a lot to us and, and the blood and tears that these guys sh shed. For retired Sergeant Major Young, seeing the next generation placing flags on the graves of the fallen soldiers this Memorial Day weekend brought tears to his eyes. It just makes us feel like there is hope for the future. Shira Matsuzawa, Fox 13 News.